Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to get into Simple and Effective Tech episode number four. Now, shout out to everybody who watched my videos. You already know what kind of video this is going to be. I got about five products I want to show y'all real quick. So in the interest of time, I'm not going to get too deep with the demonstrations, but I will show you where I got them from. I will show you the price and I give you a quick rundown on how it works. Now keep in mind, holiday season is right around the corner. These are perfect little gifts that you can pick up for your friends, your family, your co-workers, and for yourself. You know the old saying, treat yourself, don't cheat yourself. All right, so let's get right into it. First up, we got the Spigen Magnetic Air Vent Mount. All right, now all of these products I got from Amazon.com, I'll throw the links up in the description. For the Air Vent Mount, check out the price, fellas, $6.99. Alright, so you're looking at seven bucks for this. So let's see how it works. Typical speaking presentation. Pretty much straightforward. Just slap the little sticker on the back and you're gonna slap it into your car. So let's see what it looks like. And let's see what you get inside, of course. Your certificate of authenticity. You know what to do. Alright. Okay, so here's your little sticker right here. You get two of these. Alright, so these are your magnetic stickers. You get a small one and you get a big one. This is the magnet that's going to go, uh, that's going to go in your car vent. All right, so let me see. Do I have something thin? Oh, we could probably use this. All right, so imagine if this is your car vent. All right, you know you're going to have three or four of these depending on what kind of car you got. When you get in the car, all you're going to do is slap this just like this. Slap it right on there. Okay, now this is, this is rubbery right here. Rubbery. <laughs> And it, it, it sticks in there pretty good. Now your car vent is going to be a little bit thicker, so it's going to stick in there even better. Okay, just like that. That's how it's going to look on your vent. Now all you got to do is take one of these stickers. Let's see. I got, let me grab a phone. Okay, so I, matter of fact, I just happen to have a speaking case on this. Let's use the big one for this. Now this has some 3M tape on the back. Let's see if we can peel this off without taking 45 minutes. I got zero nails and zero chill. All right? <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay, so just like that, peel this off. I'm just going to stick this. Let me try to make it good since it's going to be on there for, for a minute. Stick this right onto your back of your phone or your phone case, whatever you want to do. Now, personally, I'd rather stick it to a phone case. And this will just be my permanent in the car case. So, this will be on your vent. All you got to do is get in your car drop it on just like that okay now it does form it forms a good seal it's upside down let me do the shake test let me see if I can make this fall I'm shaking as hard as I can it's not gonna come off you see this is a nice nice strong magnetic grip and let's see now even if you don't get it directly in the middle let's from the bottom it'll still stay on it'll fall off from the bottom but it'll still stay on so you don't have to line it directly up into the middle, but once it's on, it's on. Now this will be perfect for when you get in your car, if you're using GPS, if you're using FaceTime, if you're using, um, you know, say you got your Instagram, <laughs> you got your Instagram page up and you want to monitor your Instagram likes, just leave it up and just keep refreshing, whatever you want to do, all right, whatever you want to do on your phone, it'll be stuck on your vent just like this. All right, so you're talking about seven bucks for this. This certified win right here. And you get two of these. All right, so you could drop them on two different cases or I just have one for standby. I'll just leave this one on and this will be in the car. All right, so seven bucks for this. Certified win right there. I'm definitely feeling that. I thought it was going to be a lot cheaper for that price. I thought the materials was going to be cheap. But it's a nice rubberized feel to this. And that grip, that this is a strong grip. This grip ain't going nowhere. So when you're driving 100 miles an hour, hitting those potholes, you don't have to worry about your phone falling off. All right, so that's a certified win right there. Let's file that to the side. That's a go right there for seven bucks, fellas. Let's see what we got next. All right, so now next, let me show you. So let, let's take a look at this wireless charge I want to show you. All right, let me pull up the website real quick. All right, so we got the, the, the Chotec wireless charger. All right, now this is um, Qi wireless charger. This will work for your Galaxy Note 5, your Note 6, your, S, your S6 Edge, whatever phone you got, even your iPhone. If you drop a power card in there, it'll work for any phone. The price for this one right here is going to run you $19.99. All right, so 20 bucks for this. It comes in white or black. 
Okay, basic presentation. Let's see, here's your output. Output 5 volts, uh, 1, 1.5 to 2 amps. That's for your input, and your output is 5 volts, 1 amp. All right, so you're not gonna be getting that super fast charging, but you will be getting wireless charging. 20 bucks. All right, so let's see what you get inside. Okay, happy. <laughs> I like that. Oh, <laughs> not happy? <laughs> happy or not happy, I prefer happy. All right, here's your instructions. Self-explanatory. You get your micro USB charging cable. We'll plug this in and we'll test it out live real quick. And here's the base. Now on the base, you get this rubber around the bottom. That'll keep it in place on the table. Has a luminous look to it. Luminous, aluminumish look to it. I like that. Let's see if it lights up. Or, or it should light up. This looks like LED ring in here, but we'll see. So we'll plug this in. Let me grab, let's grab a charger real quick. See if we got any juice. Okay, so it does light up. All right, it, just, let me unplug it and plug it back in. All right, keep your eye on the bottom of this. You see it did light up. All right, so let's grab a phone. Let's see. Uh, let's grab a Note. Matter of fact, we'll grab the S6 Edge Plus. Let's see if this works now. Okay, so it's charging up. Now, I got my phone on silent, but as you can see, look closely. You see it's charging up. And also, if you look closely, it does light up. All right, so once it's on the charger, it lights up. Now, let me, just for fun, let's throw the sound. Matter of fact, I don't want to put too. I don't want to put the sound up because I don't want to get too many notifications. But just keep your eye on the on the phone screen, and you'll see it activate when it's charging. Let's see. Let's find this the sweet spot on this. There it goes. You see that little ring pop up, and now it's charging. All right, so 20 bucks for this. This is a win. Now, if you like me and you got a whole bunch of these uh, different wireless phone, you know, wireless charge capable phones, then I like to have wireless chargers everywhere. I don't like to have too many cables laying around, so I got wireless chargers everywhere. This is another one right here. I just like the color to this one. We'll run the wires somewhere and we'll just have this maybe in the bathroom, maybe in the kitchen or something. Just have wireless chargers everywhere. All right, just line them up all over your crib. All right, for 20 bucks, you can afford to do that. And like I said, if you're looking for a nice quick gift to give somebody, if you know they got a Galaxy S6 Edge or a Note 5 or a Nexus 6 or whatever phone they got, hit them off with one of those, 20 bucks. Let's keep it moving. Now, while we in the wireless chargers, I got, a, I got another wireless charger I want you all to see. Now, I actually did a video this for, for a while ago, and a lot of people been asking me about this. Every time they come in my office, somebody asked me this, uh, asked me about this, or they want to buy it from me. We got the phone salesman. We got the wood puck. Now this is a wireless charger right here, but it just has a certain look to it. And I'll show you real quick. Now real quick, if you go to the website, this one is gonna run you $29.99, 30 bucks. All right, and it comes in a bunch of different different colors of wood. So this is the wood puck. This is a wood, wooden wireless charger. All right, 30 bucks. All right, so let's pop this open and see what it looks like. All right, now, what color is this? This is Espresso. All right, this is espresso. That's the that's the name of the color. So inside, you get your phone salesman. Now, if you never heard of phone salesman, they make this. They make the uh, the cheese stone. This is one of my favorite wireless chargers. I'll throw the link in the in the description just in case you've never seen this. But this is one of my favorite uh, favorite wireless chargers. All right, this is a uh, a portable power bank and a wireless charger. I forget how many milliamps is on this one. Four thousand milliamps. So it's a four thousand milliamp battery charger. And it also charges up wirelessly. Y'all seen that in a lot of my videos. All right, let's get back to this now. All right, so here's the wood puck. Let's see what this is real quick. All right, this is just some phone salesman paraphernalia. You see, there goes the, the cheese stone. And y'all see me do the slim power card. And I did the cool pad. I basically I basically did everything from this company. All right? But they got quality, quality merchandise here. That's why I rock with them. Look at the cable. Little branding on the cable, little details like that. That shows you that the company put a little bit of effort into it. Now this, it feels like a piece of wood. It actually, if you look at the bottom, you see the little wood fragmentation on it. This is a piece of, let's do a smell test on this. Yeah, this is a certified piece of wood right here with the charge in the middle. So all you gotta do is plug this in and you see how it has a little slot right there? This will keep your cables 
in place. When you got it on the table and you run this behind your desk, it's going to look nice. Now, I got two of these in the office, one on each side. And whenever I drop my phone on, people always ask me, you know, how much is that, where I got it from. And, you know, it looks, looks more expensive than what it really is. All right, so let's try it out real quick. Let's grab a phone. You hear that little beep sound? You seen the little ring pop up? Look close. You see it's charging. All right, so this is the wood puck right here. Now, I don't know how you got your setup in your house or your office or wherever you at, but this just looks more elegant to me than this. Now, this, is, this one looks a little bit more futuristic, more high-tech. If you got a nice little setup with everything aluminum and black and white, cool. But if you got a nice office and everything is, you got plants and you got, you know, wood grain floors and all that, this is, this is going to look hot. All right, this is going to look hot and it definitely works. Got that little beep, let you know that it's charging right up. Now, like I said, this is one of my favorite chargers. I actually did get, get a few that I'm going to be passing out as gifts. Let's just um, open these up. Let's see if we can open them up real quick without, without ruining the box. Because <laughs> you know, like I said, 30 bucks. These are the office office gifts right here. Now this one is this one is latte. Let's check out the latte color. All right, so that's the latte color compared to the espresso. That one looks tough. All right, let's close this back up. <laughs> they don't watch my video, so <laughs> they ain't gonna know. All right, let's see. Let's let's take a look at the last one real quick. This one is chai tea or something. I don't know. Machato. I don't know. Let's see. All right, now this one looks hot too. Two-tone wood on this one, so this one kind of looks like this, but a little, little uh, two-tone stripe on there. That one looks kind of dope too. All right, so we'll we'll package these up real nice. <laughs> we'll package these up real nice. Throw these in the in the office grab bags and keep it moving. Now, depending on where you work at, most of these grab bags they don't want you to spend more than thirty bucks. This is thirty bucks right here, and it looks fancy. All right, so I'm definitely keeping this one. These two I'll be passing out. We'll keep it moving. All right, so 30 bucks for that. That's another certified win. Let's keep it moving. What we got next? Now, I got one more wireless charger I want to show y'all. I know this is this turned into the wireless charge edition. But um, <laughs> while we're on the subject of wireless chargers, might as well get them all out the way real quick. We got another speaking one. Now, this one I've been getting a lot of recommendations for. I'm definitely keeping this one because I like the look of it. But a lot of people have been telling me to check this one out. I think my man Oliver, shout out to Oliver, Samsung Knights, told me to definitely check this one out. Less than 30 bucks. Let's see. Uh, $26.99. All right, $26.99. So $27, bucks, less than 30 This is the Spigen three, coil, three Coils Wireless Charger. All right, so three coils inside. That means you can charge your phone in portrait mode or landscape mode. Okay, you got a LED light on here. All right, well, let's see how it looks. No beast mode necessary, fellas. Too early in the day. Okay. So, of course, usual books and shit. You won't need that. Oh, something just dropped. Certificate of Authenticity. Another micro USB charging cable to add to your collection. And here's the uh, wireless charger. Okay, let's see. Let's read the caution first. Okay. All right, so... Alright, so you want to make sure you use the two the two point um the two point <laughs> the, the two amp charger that came with it. Alright, you see? One amp, two amp. Alright, so you want to use the two amp one if you want that fast charge. If you use the one amp, it's still gonna charge, but it's just gonna charge slow. Alright, nice piece of plastic right here. Rubberized texture to it. Matte finish, no fingerprints. Y'all know that's important for me. On the bottom, okay, we got some rubber grips. This is going to keep it from sliding around too much on the table. A real simple to install this. Let's see. Just drop the cable right in here. I never get that on the first try. There we go. All right, so drop the cable right in here. Run this behind your desk or something and just have this sitting on your table just like this. All right, so let's grab let's charge this uh grab this chi charger. We'll see if this works now. All right, so we'll grab a phone. Let's get some power on this. There we go. If you notice, let's zoom in. It's charging up. All right, so let's see if this charges in portrait or, or landscape. Okay, so I dropped it in on landscape. It's charging. 
All right, so this is a win right here. Let's check with a case on it. Now, I got this, the Note 5 with a case on it. Getting alerts. <laughs> All right, let me see. So, now I got this. Oh, I got this. Let me let me grab another case real quick because I'm curious. Let me put my US my U USB, <laughs> my UAG case on this, and let's see if this works. Okay, so I'm getting getting no charge with the case on. Not really not really too big on that right there. No charge with this case on, but this case is kind of thick. Let me try another case. Let's try one more case, and if it doesn't charge with this case on, then it ain't gonna charge with none. All right, this is a little the thinnest. Light, lightweight case. Let's drop this one on. See if it charges with this case on. Okay, so it's charging with this case. See a little charge indicator. Alright, so the UAG case might be a little bit too thick. But just for the record, y'all know I don't like taking too many L's. Let's try one more time. Make sure I'm not taking an L to this. Oh, now look, if you notice on the bottom, there is a red LED light that lets you know it's in standby mode. Okay, so not charging with the UAG case too thick. All right, so let's take this one off. Now keep your eye on that LED light. All right, light turned to blue. All right, so it is charging. All right, so this might be one that you have to be mindful of what case you use. I have to slap the, the little TPU joint on, and we'll just rock it like this. Okay, got the blue light. This one is a go. All right, now, hmm... Hmm. <laughs> let's see. Let's let's just let's see if we can get greedy. Let's just for fun. See if we put two phones on here. No. All right. Just checking. Just just checking. Just trying to get greedy. Let's see. Nope. Just one phone at a time. I had to check. though. I had to check. All right. Well. Anyway. Thirty bucks for this. This is a win right here. I like the way the, the little stand angle like this. So this way you can still use your phone while it's on the charging dock. Alright, so less than 30 bucks for that. I consider that a win. Consider that a certified win. Keep in mind, fellas, this ain't just for us. These are little gifts also that you want to give out to people. Holiday season is right here. Now, this one right here, I really want to check out. I got some <laughs> I got some light up headphones. Alright, now I had my eye on these for a minute. I actually ordered these a long time ago. The light up headphones. Now, if you look. You see, I ordered these on September 1st, all right, but I haven't got around to playing with these just yet. 27 bucks for these. All right, so these are the, the, the Volvo in-ear light-up headphones. Okay, syncs, now it syncs with the beat of your music. Okay, let's see, let's, let's see. Um, new style flashing lights, start, press for three seconds, so lights will start performing. All right, well, we'll let's, let's figure this out real quick. Let's figure this out. All right, so... 27 bucks for this, $28. 27 dollars 28 bucks. Micro USB charging port. Okay. Now, L light on buttons. Okay, L light off buttons. All right. Looks simple enough. I gotta cut all my finger. <laughs> oh boy. All right, let's 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 see what these look like now. Now that day on saving time is about to hit and it's gonna be dark real early. These might be the headphones I'm gonna be rocking while I'm outside, riding my bike in the middle of the night. Let's see. All right, so light up headphones. Now you have to charge these up, okay? You have to charge these up. Let's power them on, let's see now. When do you have to power these on? Might have to take it to the book on these ones, fellas. Let's see, Um, do I got something plugged in? Let's see if this, let's see if we can charge these up for a second. Okay, so there's a, a power light right there. They, they are charging. All right, so you know what? Let me try these first. Let's try them first. Live videos, fellas. No editing allowed. Let's try these first and see if they light up. Otherwise, we'll have to charge them up for a minute and we'll, we'll look at the last product and we'll try these out. All right, so let me take it to my Amazon Music. Let's throw in a song real quick. Let's see. Ba, 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 ba. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, fellas, I know. Okay. All right. All right, so I got some music on right here. 
Let me see now. Can I hear these? All right, now I hear the music playing. Let's get maximum volume. See how these sound, first of all. You hear the music? All right, now, let me see if, hit the power button, see if these light up at all. Now, I had these in the house for a minute. Let's double tap. So far, I don't see any lights on these. Let's, let's, let's make sure. Are they, yeah. No lights on these just yet. They could, the battery could be dead though. Battery could be dead. All right, so what I'll do is, matter of fact, I don't wanna waste too much time. Let's plug these in, plug these in, let it charge up for a few minutes. And then by the time we, uh, you see it's charging. All right, so by the time we finish looking at this last product, they should have enough juice, enough juice to uh, see if it works or not. All right, so let's keep it moving. Got one more thing I wanna show y'all. Now this is gonna be perfect for the kids. All right, now that's one of the primary reasons I got this. We got the, the Go Groove. All right, we got a Go Groove. This is the Blue Sync RST. This is a wireless speaker and alarm clock and a phone stand. All right, so let me show you the price on this one real quick. Now, this is the most expensive one in this uh, episode. This, <laughs> this one's gonna run you $54.99. Alright, let's, let's, let's check out some of the features real quick, because I personally don't know. Uh, not just another alarm clock, the Blue Sync RST also functions as a Bluetooth speaker, FM radio, USB charger, and viewing stand. Now, this will work with your iPhone 6 Plus, Galaxy Note 5, LG G4, and more. This is equipped with NFC and offers a simple and fun way to pair instantly. Let's see, um, after a one-time introduction, touch your NFC-capable tablet or smartphone to your device, and you're good to go. Alright, let's see, uses Bluetooth 2.1. Easy to use onboard controls for pairing, volume control, pause, play, and even answer and phone calls. The RS, the RST also comes with a remote control for adjusting the settings at a distance. Now backed by a three-year manufacturer's warranty. I like that. All right, so all of that, 55 bucks for this. All right, 55 bucks for this one. Let's see how it looks. Let's make sure this thing is still charging. All right, I'm curious about them headphones, though. Ah, <laughs> oh, that shit's still stuck in my mind. All right, let's check out the Go Groove, though. See what this is all about. Now, you notice I'm not going too beast with the packing because depending on how this looks, I might have to re-gift this. Okay, so that's the box right there. Don't worry, when you hear stuff hitting the ground, I, I, I'm a master re-gifter. All right, usual books and shit. You might have to go through this. It looks like a lot of, a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff on this. Okay, little remote control. Looks like a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable. Now this is your plug, you're gonna have to plug this in to operate it. Okay, decent packing. Here's the battery for your remote control. Here's the clock. Now I thought the clock was gonna be a lot bigger, but I'm glad it's not. Nice little small clock right here, okay? Hard press buttons, there's your power. That looks like snooze. You got answer and end phone calls. Okay, this is snooze. So this might be nighttime mode, dim the clock a little bit. Alarm clock, playing pause. Here's your FM antenna, old school style. Just run this along the side of the wall and just uh, tape it up to the wall. You get your FM radio. Now, when you want to put your phone in, just gonna put it just like this. Put it portrait, landscape. Put it backwards, whatever you want to do. All right, put your phone in just like that. All right, now, y'all want to plug this in real quick? All right, you know what? Why not? Why not? Why not? Let's plug this in real quick. I think I got a plug right here. And let's test Let's test this out. I could pause the video, but I'm not in the mood to do any editing today. Sorry, fellas. So just talk amongst yourself for one second. Let me plug this in. I got a plug right here. All right, so let's plug this in. Let's see how this works. Okay, so, okay, matter of fact, before I do that, let me show you how the back. There's a lot of stuff going on back here. You got your auxiliary in. This is my um, USB. All right, so I'm assuming that you probably could charge something with that. That's your time. Set the time. Plus and minus. And that's your AC, uh, DC 5 volts. All right, so plug this in just now. Let's hit the, okay, there it goes. I said I saw your clock is going to look, let's see, um, 
Okay, you got 12, 20, 12 and 24 hour. Let's see what time is it. It's... Okay. I'm not going to really set this. Let's just say it's 7. Let's just say it's 7.50. 7 <laughs> 7.50. We just make up our own time. All right, so that's the time right there. All right, so let's see now. Where's the NFC? Where's the NFC located at on this? Let's try it. Let's see if we can pair this up with NFC. Okay, pair, pair device, hit yes. Could it have been that easy? Oh, here go the NFC locator right there. See a little NFC? Let's see. Well, let's see. Was it was 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 it that easy? Okay, no, of course not. <laughs> of course it wasn't that easy. Right, let's try this again. Okay, we hit yes. Pair in blue sync. Okay, y'all seen that for yourself. Okay, failed to pair. Alright, let's let's disconnect my my gear S2. Alright, now let's let's try this again. Okay. Pair in blue sync. Okay. Failed to pair. All right, so a lot of times when that happens, you end up having to restart your phone and then it works. Let's try another phone. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's try another phone. Okay, pair, pair device. Let's hit yes. Now I do got a lot of stuff connected to these uh, phones, but that's no excuse. All right, not pairing. Okay, we'll try one more time. We'll try one more time. I hate I hate losing to electronics. But it looks that way right now. Looks like I'm taking a loss. I right, failed to pair. Let's see if we can manually pair this. I just want to hear how this sounds now. Now that I'm getting mad. <laughs> now that I'm getting mad, let's see if we can uh, let's see. Let's matter of fact, let's turn this off and on. All right, <laughs> I'll unplug it, plug it back in. All right, 50 bucks for this, fellas. All right, now, once you unplug it, you will have to set the time again. Let's try this again now. Let's hit yes. Okay, failed to pair. All right, well... Now, now I now I have to now I have to know how it sounds. I, I must know. So I'm gonna pause the video. I might have to take it to this to this book that I hate. I might have to take it to the book real quick, but we'll see. All right. So I I gotta hear how this sounds now for 50 bucks. Is it gonna be worth you buying it and and going through the struggle that I'm going through? And I have to find out. All right. So talk amongst yourselves. I'll be right back in a second. Let me pair this up. All right, y'all. So I don't wanna waste too much time. I took it to the book. I hit the power button, I hit the source, told me to hit that little S source button. A Bluetooth indicator pay, uh, popped up on the screen, so now it popped up on the phone. All right, so the NFC pairing, I couldn't get it to connect, I don't know. I didn't want to waste too much time with that, but we'll see if we can pair it using regular Bluetooth. All right, so regular Bluetooth, it did connect. All right, so there we go. Now, let's take it to the SoundCloud, let's throw in some music real quick, and let's see how this sounds. I'm not expecting this to sound over the top crazy, but we'll see. Okay, let's get maximum volume. All right, Nick, if you look on the screen. So cool shit. I sold love for I sell out like a cruise ship. 80k on the cash out, make my mood skip. No time for your new slips to a new sense. when you do shit. Chasing money lately. I was hoping you could chase with me. 
the one I can relay with. So if you would it, then just say it. Okay. If you ain't miss, save it. Cause you like this. I'm never like it. At this point, I'm too important to speak business. I hear these little niggas sneak this in. I'm in Cali for three weeks missing. Like some OT shit. Start rolling up some OG shit. On the yacht for like five days, got a C6. She said, okay. <laughs> song is hype. Right. The song is hype. Does this sound like trash on this? Because the speaker ain't really nothing. But it's alright though, it's alright. That's loud enough, that'll wake you up in the morning. Okay, let's see on the bottom. Got a little button chart, on and off, sleep timer, set alarm, play, pause, answer the phones. Alright, it's, it's a lot of features on this. Now, I was just breezing through the book, and it does have a lot of features. Alright, now, I just couldn't get the NFC to pair up, <laughs> but it is what it is. It is what it is. Alright, so imagine you're sleeping, and you got this, let's see, you got this set on volume max, and your alarm goes off. Go. Swing your mom name, your key flip. I tell them it's all shit. They like all shit. Damn, so niggas. That's loud enough to wake you up. That's loud enough to wake you up. Let's see. Um. Alright, that's a long. Yeah, little. Now, nah, old school, old school style clock. Alright, let's see. I'm just pr pressing random buttons. Alright, so that's power. And source. Let's see. Alright, so you do have auxiliary. That's auxiliary, so if you want to use the 3.5 millimeter cable, play something else like that, that's cool. All right, so basically, basically 50 bucks you're paying for an alarm clock that does have Bluetooth capabilities and a phone stand. And like I said, this would be perfect, perfect for the little kids or perfect for your office. Because in your office, when you're playing music, you don't really need a Harman Kardon or a Big Blue or a JBL Extreme in your office playing music because you're going to have the volume low anyway. So something like this, this might be cool for the office. Set your little alarm for when it's time to go to lunch. Set another uh, alarm for 10 minutes before you're getting ready to go home. So once, you, once the music come on, you know whatever you're doing, drop that. Start packing it up. All right, so this ain't bad right here. 50 bucks, like I said. I'll repackage that and we'll, uh, we'll pass that off to the next cat. All right, now, let's take a look at these headphones real quick. Now, they've been charging all that time. I want to see some lights on this. All right, so let's plug this in. Let's get to the music real quick. See if we get some light action going on this. Let me find some music. Right, I'm, 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 I'm trying to I'm trying to find some music. I don't want to throw in the I don't want to throw in the Teddy Pendergrass here. Too early for that. But um, I'm still not seeing any lights on this yet. I got the music on. Let me let me find a song that got some some bass. Song to have a little bit of bass to it. All right, here we go. All right, so I'm going to throw some Drake, Find Your Love. Let's wait for the music to drop on this. Now, you hear the music is on this. All right, so let's unplug this. Let's hit the power button on these. All right, there we go. Now we got some lights. Let's turn this off. Now, if y'all can see. Oh, it's going with the beat. All right, let me hit the last light so y'all can get the full effect. All right, so this, <laughs> yeah, these are hype. Now I'm, I'm pretty sure when you charge it up, they're gonna have, it's gonna have more light to it. It's bouncing with the beat though. All right, now these are the earbuds. Let me find the earbuds. These are the two earbuds. So this is how it's gonna look when you're wearing them. Oh, it's bouncing with the beat. That's kind of sick. Now, I, I, let me see. Let's hold down the button. Okay, so that's turn it off. Let's press the button once. All right, you press the button once, that pauses it. Let's hold the button down again. All right, so these, the, all right, I got to play with the, with the book and all that, but the lights are bouncing with the music. That's kind of sick, fellas. That's kind of sick. All right, I like that. I like that. All right, so check these out for yourself. Oh, I like that. I like that. All right, I'm, I, I like that. That's cute. It's pretty cute. All right, so I'm going to charge these up fully. I wonder if they fully charge up. Will they be even brighter? I don't know. We'll see. But this is a win right here. All right? This is a win for that little price. What was the price on these again? Let me see. 
wasn't too much. I, I forgot. Maybe $25, $22. All right. Oh, 27 bucks. All right. 27 bucks for these. That ain't bad. Now, this will this will make a nice little gift to for somebody who ain't going to like some light up headphones that light up according to the beat. That's pretty slick. All right. So there you have it. That's simple but effective tech episode number four. If y'all like these kind of videos, I get a whole bunch of these products all the time. I could do some more of these. If you don't like the video, then <laughs> then oh well. But uh, anybody that liked the video, y'all know, leave a comment if y'all want me to uh, try out something specific. Shout out to Oliver for putting me on to the speaking uh, charger. If you got any recommendations, just hit me up and I'll check them out. All right, now, a lot of people have been telling me to check out the Diamond Box. I will check that out probably after the holidays, see if the price drop a little bit. Because they told me about $1,000 for that. And I don't really see myself paying $1,000 for a Bluetooth speaker. I don't really see that happening. $1,000, that, that's a home entertainment system prices. You know what I'm saying? So maybe the price drop for the holidays or after the holidays, then we'll get into that. In the meantime, JBL Extreme, <laughs> Big Blue Party, the new Beats, the Beats pill got a, I think it's a pill S or something like that. Beats got a pill coming out. We'll get into that too. Now, I got some other videos I'll do later on today. I got a whole bunch of new battery chargers. We'll check those out. Got a whole bunch of new headphones. We'll check those out. iPhone just came in the mail a few minutes ago. We'll pop that open and we'll start playing with all this new shit. All right, but hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about all this stuff. So far out of this video, though, this magnetic mount, I'm definitely keeping because I'm going to use this in my car for sure. This wood puck is serious. This is just a utility. I'll probably throw this in the bathroom. That's utility. I'm definitely keeping this. I'm giving away that clock. <laughs> because it ain't really my style. It's cool, but it's more. it looks a little bit more kitty. So I'll probably give that to my daughter, you know, set that up in her room and she can play with that. And um, the headphones, I'm definitely keeping these. I'm going to fool around with these at night when I'm riding my bike. And that's just one more thing to have on you to keep you from getting hit by a car in the middle of the night. All right, so we'll play around with these. We'll see if they come in some different colors. I didn't really scan the internet too much, but I'm pretty sure if they make them in blue, then they make them in green and they make them in red, probably yellow and white too. We'll see. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rock with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the Amazon Warrior on Sundays. Y'all already know, Stream Gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, shout out to the Scissor Squad. Shout out to the Donut Boys. Shout out to the Limp Boys. Bunny is on deck. Y'all know, this Sunday is going down heavy. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. And of course, I gotta play with these headphones one more time. Let's see how they look one more time. Yeah, these is alright though. These is alright. <laughs> Let's see, um, let's let, let put the music on max volume. Alright, this is that game joint. The game in um, Days Loaf. Alright, so nice amount of light though. Okay, now it gets a little bit dim coming toward the bottom. But at the top, it's nice and bright. So this is the part that's really going to be showing right in your ears. This is cool. Alright, it's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces.